Hello and welcome. I'm going to learn how to construct an ellipse using concentric circle method. So in the other question to guide us, draw an ellipse of major axis 19 mm and minor axis 60 mm using concentric circle method. So because we have a circle, so it means that we have two circles. We have the first circle which is our major circle of diameter 90 mm. So we have diameter 90 mm. And then we have this smaller circle of diameter 60 millimeters. So it means the radius of this is 45 millimeters. And the radius of the minor circle is 30 millimeters. So we're going to draw the two circles of radius 45 and of radius 30 millimeters. So I'm going to take to measure my 45 millimeters my compass so and draw that circle so I have my first circle my second circle we have 30 millimeters is our radius so we're going to use the same same center and I'm going to draw the minor circle from there i'm going to divide this circle into 12 equal parts and remember we said we're going to use our 60 or 30 60 that is our set square of 30 degrees to divide into 12 equal parts I'm going to use this to divide into 12 equal parts. It is very simple to divide. You can see it is the simplest. You can as well use your compass. So we already have our 12 divisions. So you can name this one. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, and 12. Now from there, so we're going to draw a line from the circumference of our smaller circle. You can see our point 11, this is our line 11, where it touches the circumference of the smaller circle. And then we have this number 9, where it touches the circumference of our smaller circle. We're going to draw a line, a straight line. From there, we're going to drop also a straight line from point 11 to touch our line so we have one of our point our first point and then our second point repeat the same at point 12 and 8 draw a line draw a line now we drop a vertical line from point 12 to touch our horizontal line. So I have this point, our next point, and the other. So we go to, so we have another point, as point 1 and point 7. So we move to point six and two so we have that we draw a horizontal line and then from there from point two we draw a vertical line to touch the horizontal line have that this other end so we have this point and you have that point 
and then have the final part we have three and five so I draw a horizontal line horizontal line 1.3 going to draw a vertical line and then vertical line so we already have the points remember it's going to pass also through this point this point and one and seven so we already have all the points so we join the points free art using your hb pencil So we already have our ellipse and remember the method method is concentric circle method thank you